while you're hanging out here at the pool. I thought I would share this with you because it's part of that medallion class that is just amazing. And if, if you haven't watched any of my other videos, this is the medallion. And you wear it, you have different options. And it, it works with your app that's on your phone. And I'm gonna show you that process right now. So let's order a, let's order a margarita, okay? So I'm gonna turn the camera towards my phone. And uh, you know, hey, it's not perfect. Hopefully you can see everything. But I just wanted to share it with y'all. All right, here you go. So right now I'm going to, I have my app open and this process is under this little icon right here. And this is where you would go to order a beverage or something that, oops, it's kind of hard to do and hold the camera, sorry about that. Order and for delivery with uh, my Ocean Now medallion, so I'm gonna select that. It tells you to enjoy it on board while I'm experiencing it. So I have to select that. All right, so now I've got a better grip. I'm gonna order a beverage. And here's all your selections. I'm gonna move it forward here to a margarita. It sounds really good. Let's see if I see any margaritas. I think I passed it. All right, there's the margaritas. Okay, so it looks like I have three choices and it's included in my beverage package. It shows it right there at the top. It also shows where it's gonna be delivered to. So I had one of these yesterday, the 24 karat gold margarita. It was really delicious, so I'm gonna go ahead and... So inside that will show all the ingredients or garnishes, so you can tell it that you want the standard recipe. And let's see if there's any other choices. Yeah, so how you want it. So I'm gonna have it blended, or maybe I should have it on the rocks. Um, you know what, I'm gonna have it on the rocks this time. All right, and then down here, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna have any salt on the rim. So I'm gonna save that. And it shows all my, double check everything. It tells you the price, which when you have the beverage package, it's just included. And then you have the garnish, make sure you put it the right way. And then it shows all my modifications. So I'm gonna add that to the cart. All right, so there is, uh, in the basket and I can hopefully not drop the phone. Let's see if I can go in here. So I'm gonna go out to the checkout now. Okay, so now I'm gonna go to my basket and it shows my total and it shows the discount and then I just push this little button down here called order now. Alright so there it goes. It's showing that um, here's my order has been placed and we'll see in just a couple minutes when it arrives, okay? So it's, let's see, what time is it now? It's 12.35 and I am just gonna see how long it actually takes to get the item. I'm just gonna sit here, relax, enjoy the scenery and I'll come right back as soon as my margarita arrives. All right, I'll tell you all about it, bye-bye. All right, so I just looked at my phone and it showed a notification that the drink is on the way. And so there it is right there. You can see that it shows the sailboat above the sign that says, on the way. So it sounds like my margarita has been made and it's ready to get to me. We're just waiting to see when it arrives. All right, pretty slick, huh? All right. Right. Wow. There you go, sir. Thank yeah. you very much. Thank you. Look at that beautiful margarita. Yeah, it's very, yeah, it's nice. very nice. Thank you. All right. So the margarita just showed up. Do you have any straws? All right. So it took about just under 14 minutes. Not bad. And this margarita looks so good. Yesterday I had this and it didn't have the fruit. So it comes with a lime and a strawberry thank you very much so yeah very nice except uh, i put no salt and i got salt so it's not perfect let's give this margarita a try okay oh that's delicious it's got a lot of grand manier in it 
awesome awesome all right i'm gonna enjoy this and the beautiful scenery and i'll see you guys shortly goodbye all right guys so i went to the lunch buffet to have some lunch today and so i'm going i'll show you what i had but i took a whole bunch of photos of what the food looks like and I'll have to hand it to him it looks amazing so here here's what I had so I had some fried rice tandoori chicken sweet and sour pork and some sweetest meatballs so that will tide me over until dinner I'll see you guys after this and we'll do some more goodies all right see you in a bit after a nice lunch I had a salad a little bit of nachos and uh oh I brought something back here take a look I got a apple cupcake and some lemon cookies yeah I figured I have those a little later maybe on the balcony overlooking this uh, so so kind of day it's not that nice out take a look a little overcast that's okay though anyway so I thought I'd just go relax, get myself cleaned up a little bit and figure out what I'm gonna do the rest of the afternoon. I'll see you guys in a few. Look at what's out here right now. This carnival's ship, it's the Panorama and uh, it's just cruising with us all the way. How cool is that? It's kind of a chilly afternoon right now. I wish it wasn't. But you can see the white caps in the water, as you can see. Look at that, huh? We're kind of moving, huh? All right, look at the wakes up there. And we're just cutting through that. It's kind of cool, huh? It's kind of a pretty sea day. I wish it was warmer, but it's supposed to be nice tomorrow in the 70s, and we're going to be in Cabo San Lucas. Uh, that's going to be, oh my gosh, I have a tour. Yeah, so <laughs> you might want to click that subscribe button because it's going to be really fun. And you guys know, if you haven't, no, no kidding. It is over a hundred, a hundred new subscribers in the last 
uh, month, one month. That's a record for my channel, and I want to thank you all. And uh, I got a huge, a really fun tour coming tomorrow, and I think it's fitting. Everybody out there, I put out some surveys in the last couple of weeks. Uh, one was particularly for Hawaii, but this one that I'm doing for this trip became part of that survey. You like my food uh, segments, so. I did a farm to table tour for tomorrow and uh, so I thought that would be kind of fun and I'll see if I'll and some of you actually made a couple comments uh, how much food knowledge do I have well um, I was in the restaurant industry for over 35 years I retired from that uh, just after the pandemic started my mom was a travel agent she owned a travel agency and I knew about it from her <laughs> so it was a good fit for me to you know turn on the YouTube and turn you guys on to travel so why not it's what I do full-time now and uh, this is what is allowing me to do all these things so thanks to the subscribers thanks to the people that book with me uh, thank you very much and so the point is that tomorrow I'm going on this tour and I will get into more technical details because uh, you've actually asked so and what I mean by that is method and how things are made um, so why not all right I hope you guys can see that episode I'm looking forward to uh, being a part of that and I hope you enjoy anyways I'm gonna leave you now looking at the panorama and of course I will see you guys in just a few minutes tonight is oh my gosh I can't believe it it's it's formal night so I have a 520 reservation for dinner I've actually asked for a table by myself instead of with people so that I can give a food review for you guys yeah so yeah um, this morning I did that uh, review of breakfast it was outstanding and with this equipment obviously um, being by myself at a table gives me that opportunity to share my thoughts and my, my opinions of the food and that's why I'm gonna do it that way um, so more to that to come all cruise long all right we'll see you guys in a bit get over this it's dinner time all right I got all changed and ready to go and I am excited because it's formal night and elegant I mean elegant night so it's a very nice menu and I will be bringing you along to enjoy and I'll see you guys in just a moment bye bye it's a nice but the hallways are a little narrow so when you walk by you have to really pay attention <laughs> you knock somebody over all right I'm on my way and tonight's special menu is an Easter menu today is Easter and one is gracious this this crab I can barely put it out here there we go so the crab and Monterey Jack cheese quiche they have duck liver pate oh my goodness look at this what would you have oh man look at all these yummies hmm wow well we're in for a treat tonight all right guys i'll see you in just a moment with the the um the duck liver pate and of course i had to have uh the bacon uh, potato chowder and then I did something else what else did I have oh, I did the wa roasted wa walnut salad and then for dinner I did the ham gotta have the ham on Easter so I'm gonna have some of my bread here and enjoy the company in the dining room the waiters have been super friendly they even put my napkin in my lap <laughs> all right guys see you in a minute uh, looks amazing all right so it came on a crostini and uh, I'm not sure what the powder is it might be something very simple I'm gonna taste it and I'll I'll figure it out and then 
a compote of some sort. And I love the detail that they put on the, uh, the chive on top of the compote. So uh, let me get it situated. I'll put it on a cracker or the crostini <laughs> and uh, I'll give it a shot. Of course, I'll have you with me. I'll be right back. Okay, so I put the uh, pate on the crostini and some of the compote and let's see how it tastes, all right? Mmm. Mm. Wow. That's delicious. Mm. Wow. The compote is raspberry and the chive. I put it on that piece and it just it was perfect. So hats off. Delicious. Oh, I'm gonna enjoy this. And I ordered the French red wine. Now there's no way I can pronounce that word, <laughs> but he recommended it, so. And it went very well, paired very nice, all right. I'm gonna enjoy this, I'll be back in just a moment. All right, bye. Wow, okay, I came back because that compote sweetened up the pate, so I tried it without the, the compote, and it's just really, really delicious. Oh, wow. I'm impressed so far. I can't wait for the chowder. All right, see you in a minute. It was excellent. By the way, that green line down below was ground pistachios. <laughs> awesome. I just, it was a lot of flavors. And I don't know if they did that to mask the, the liver, but to me, you didn't need it, but it was still excellent. And uh, the raspberries were really tart, so excellent overall. I thought it was excellent. Oh, wow. Okay, I can't wait to find the next episode here. <laughs> All right, see you in a minute. All right, so you have, I have asked for some fresh black, black pepper. So he brought the pepper mill over, and then you can see the cheddar cheese on top. So I figured, first of all, my I love hot, hot soup so i can tell you that it is hot because it can see the steam coming out and it's very creamy so and it has that consistency of chowder so let me give it a shot oh wow that's really really good <laughs> it reminds me of a baked potato with bacon and well hence the bacon chowder excellent job all right two for two let's see i'll be back all right let's see what we got some fresh pepper getting on there that's perfect thank you very much sir oh wow so this is the roasted um, walnut and goat cheese salad yeah what a great meal so far and um i love the presentation it's it's very fresh and I can tell that's a nice balsamic vinegar. Uh, let me give it a try. Let's see what we have here. We have some, is this what I think it is? Yes, it's, so it's a column, or no, it's a grape. So that's a grape and the fresh walnuts and the goat cheese. Let's give that a whirl. Get a little bit of everything in there. If I can get it on there. And some caramelized red onions or pickled red onions mm -hmm. Wow that goat cheese is so rich and the grape mm -hmm. mm. and with the grape it it sweetened it up a little bit, but that goat cheese is amazing. And the the walnut, they like candied the walnuts, so it was good balance of everything. Great job, awesome! I can't wait to uh, have the uh, ham. I'll bring you guys back in a minute. Wow! Bye. The service, I've got to tell you, it's outstanding. I'm watching the whole dining room move, and. 
every presentation of every entree has been amazing. They take all the steps and no shortcuts. Nobody's running around in any way. Very relaxed atmosphere. Uh, I put my fork and my knife on my plate and they took it away and they just brought me a brand new set. And that's been for every course. Those are the little touches that I like in the dining room in Princess. It's just, it makes it. It really does. And if you don't want to have a fresh fork, I'm sure it's not a problem. But it, it sure was nice. All right, folks. I'm going to wait for my entree. And then, oh boy, am I going to have some ham tonight? All right, we'll see you guys in a few seconds. Go ahead. Yes, please. A little bit more. Oh, perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All right, my ham just arrived. Wow. I can smell the smell. It's so, oh my gosh, this just smells so delicious. I, I'm going to say, I'm going to say it's going to be delicious. All right, let's give it a shot. Let's see. The roasted potatoes look amazing. The gravy, green beans, and the, and the plate, I just touched it, is piping hot. So, yeah, let me show you something. You can tell that that was just sliced. It wasn't sitting under any warmer. All right, let's give it a whirl. Oh, I can slice it with my fork. It's a very good sign. Thank you so much. All right, let's see. <laughs> That's a very good ham. Wow, that sauce that they put on it is I can't describe it. It's like a, a maple sauce. They, it's, it's a maple flavor with maybe some of the drippings of the ham. It's a little salty and a little sweet. Wow, great job. I'm happy. And the green beans and the carrots are fresh. Nice and it's piping hot. All right guys, I'm gonna enjoy this and I'll bring you back when I figure out what I'm gonna have for dessert. One thing I love about Princess is their coffee drinks. <laughs> you guys know me and coffee and I will order one tonight so we can go to the show. All right folks, I'm gonna enjoy my dinner. I'll see you guys in a minute. Delicious dinner. <laughs> hey, you know, I can't complain about dinner. That's for dang sure. I had, so I just talked to the waiter and for my coffee drink, we're gonna do something different. And he recommended this drink because um, he said it was delicious and we're going to Mexico. It's going to be, oh, and here's the menu. All right, perfect, thank you very much. Wow, what a big menu for dessert. Wow, I'll show you just now. But I'll tell you right now, Oh, wow. Well, well, I'll show you the menu, but um, my point was that it is a coffee drink with uh, Kahlua and tequila, and uh, yeah, so that sold me right at the beginning, and it gives me plenty of yums. So let me show you the menu, okay? These are the drinks, and then the dessert. Kahlua, wow. Wow, 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 wow. There's plenty to choose from. Nice. Okay, so what would you have? Write a comment below. Awesome, okay. I'll let you know what I had in just a second. Let me figure it out. Bye. Waiter came over and presented a special this evening, which uh, a flourless chocolate cake it's one of my favorites, <laughs> so I ordered both. <laughs> and then I ordered the, uh, so it's like a Spanish coffee, but it's called a Mexican coffee. So if you're familiar with the Spanish coffee, it's just substituting um, the ingredient uh, with tequila instead of rum or the 151. Generally rum 151 is gonna be a little bit better as far as flavor goes, but I'm, I am going to Mexico, so we gave that a whirl. 
and, and I see there's a presentation, so I'll have to share that with you. I just saw him organizing it, so if he's going to flame it, we're going to film it, which is rare on a ship, by the way. Yeah, thank you very much. All right, let's see what happens. I'll make sure I bring you right back. So I just noticed some of the levels of service, and one of those things were as the guests are checking in at the front door and if they have a cocktail in their hand, they grab a plate or a platter with a napkin on it and they take the drinks from their hand and put it on the platter and walk them to the table. It's that extra touch that I was talking about that is super cool. I mean, I've been, don't get me wrong, I've been in fine dining restaurants all my life, but you can't do that on this level. It, it, it's a massive amount. Hey guys, um, it's just a different level. And to have that kind of experience in a, on a cruise ship, it's really cool. I'm glad that they're doing these things. They make the biggest difference. All right guys, back to waiting for my drink. I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, so there's... Oh, Mexic, all right, very nice. Okay. And that looks delicious. Oh my. Look at all these. Oh yeah, my goodness. Oh wow. Look at it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Wow, look at this. So this is that sauce. And that's what I was talking about. Is that it had it's a consistency. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you very much, sir. Okay, no oh. That's perfect. Thank you so much. So, the Zabion, it looks like hollandaise sauce, and that's what I was talking about. Uh, so, I'm kind of glad I got that. But look at the presentation of this. Wow. Okay. That's so beautiful. Wow. How cool is that? All right, so we have my, it's the Mexican coffee. I got a meal here in front of me, folks. <laughs> and of course, did you see how they put the cream in my coffee for me as well? That happened this morning and I was taken back a little bit because it's been a while since I've had that kind of service. So I'm gonna try everything, of course, with you guys, the coffee is, it's, it's even better than this morning. All right, I'm gonna try the uh, Italian orange cake is with the Zabion. All right. Oh, the candy orange is so amazing. And the Zabion sauce is super creamy and delicious. Oh my gosh, that's excellent. It's a great palate changer. I gotta have some coffee. All right, so the next item is the special. This is the flourless chocolate cake. And this, this isn't an egg, by the way. It, it's kind of maybe, you know what? It's, it's more of a custard. It might be vanilla. I'll let you know in just a second. And it's got a really, it's got a crust. So it looks like an egg. So we gotta try it all together, let's see. And I don't know what this is either, but let's see. Mm. Wow. Okay. And the, and the little red dots is raspberries and with the chocolate shaving and the, let's see oh wow so this is like cotton candy and sponge cake <laughs> how cool impressive okay last thing to try is these the mexican coffee I bet it's really hot i bet you it, it is so all right i'm gonna get a little messy here it looks like Mm. Okay, I like the difference in flavor between 
a Spanish and a Mexican. <laughs> the Spanish coffee is very similar. They just use a 151, but this is still excellent. So I got a little bit of work here to do. I'll come back after this and, and I'm gonna take you guys to the show tonight. I haven't seen this show, so I thought I, I would definitely take you. All right, that's my dinner. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye. Oh my gosh, every chair is, it's a little on the snugger side for me. I'm a bigger guy, but uh, yeah, here's a beautiful thing is that I have the best seat in the house, I feel. So here's my view and look at how gorgeous this theater is. So the name of the show is called Sweet Soul Music and I'm here at the early show, which is great because then I can go to bed at my normal hour. <laughs> you guys all know that I get up super early, right? Anyway, so this is the plan. I'm enjoying everything right now. And I'm glad that you guys are watching. I enjoy everything. Now, if this is a copyrighted show, I can't film. But I will tell you, I'll try. Um, if it allows. If not, I'll take pictures and then I'll share those in here. All right, folks. We'll see you soon. Thanks again for watching. Bye. Wow, and wow, that's what I gotta say about that show I just went to. It was copyright protected, which I figured as much, but the live band, the live music was spectacular. The people that were main role singers were over the top, I'm telling you. It was an amazing production. You can have a really good good talent and then you can have amazing talent and that's the show I just saw what a gorgeous gorgeous crew they did a fantastic job the only way you could appreciate it is if you were in the sh in the showroom and watching that episode it was amazing amazing so yeah the talent to just a live band they had a live music uh, the singers were phenomenal and I, I just can't I can't get over it so what a beautiful view what a beautiful sunset as you can see over here and I can see the ship over there that is the carnival panorama still with us huh look at this view what a gorgeous view here so yeah it's seven and I think eight eight o'clock so, oh my gosh, it's almost nine o'clock. <laughs> what a day, fun-filled day. I was, it was morning to night, non-stop sea day. And oh, so right above me is the sea walk that we did earlier today. You wanna to take a look at it. Look at this, isn't that something? Wow, how fun. I put that on my Instagram this afternoon. I hope you had a chance to check that out. And if you haven't, you should go ahead over to Instagram and, and uh, subscribe, be a part of the party. All right, folks, tomorrow we're gonna be in Cabo. We get there around 11 o'clock. And as I mentioned on my balcony earlier, that is where we are going on a tour and it's a food tour. As you've pretty much figured out by now, I'm sure, 
I do all the food I eat, I show you. <laughs> I know that sounds funny, but if you want to know about food, I can tell you about it. And if I like it, I will be honest with you. If I don't, I'm not really that harsh, but I don't film it. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, I'm honest about it, and that's why uh, this is important to me. Uh, thanks again for subscribing, those that have. I've, wow, 100 subscribers in the last month, and it's still growing. Today we had five subscribers today alone. Thank you very much. I appreciate you all. If you're new to the channel, I'm excited to be a part of YouTube, and this has been uh, an, an adventure, so awesome. All right, guys. We'll see you guys soon. See you tomorrow. Yeah. We'll see if uh, we can change up breakfast maybe a little bit and try a different venue for, uh, for you all to see. All right. So we don't get to port until 11. I might actually sleep in if I can. If not, then it'll be coffee time with Jeffrey. All right, guys. So we'll see you in a bit. Bye-bye.